Hello, Zipbird, and welcome back to Super Mario Odyssey. And today, we're hopefully gonna be finishing up the Luncheon Kingdom. Let's go! So it might be a little bit of a hybrid episode. We only need four more purple coins and uh, eight plus three is 12 or 11. So yeah, I have a couple. I figured we should probably hire the Hint Toad for his helpful work because I've been looking high and low and I'm starting to really slow down with finding some of these moons. I don't want to take forever with it. So hopefully we can buy a couple and he will give us a sort of some good pointers. So we got one over there on that building. Not building, but uh, island, probably. Uh, we'll do three of these. That'll get us started pretty well. And then hopefully we can collect some coins on the way. That'll make it even easier. One way over there. That is right by the uh, the pond. So maybe there is another golden radish around here. And then we'll try to find another one. What will this one be? This one would be way over there. Okay, so a couple worth finding. Let's get started with those. This one probably will be pretty easy. It's probably ground pounding something or throwing Cappy onto something, you know? Something like that. So if we can find that, that'd be good. Let's get started. I see you little lava dude. We're gonna pop out. Over here. Gotcha. Okay, so. Which one was it? Was it this one? Oh yes, I can already see it. Boom, there you go. Pretty easy. Can't believe I messed up one island of salt floating in the lava. I mean, yeah. Everything is gonna serve a purpose in this game, so I should've probably pieced it together when that was just sitting there doing nothing. Um, We've been in this little cave, yeah. We definitely have, but I'm just really curious as to where these last four tomato coins are gonna be. I mean, at this point, I mean, they could be just about everywhere and anywhere and nowhere. You ate too much? <laughs> I know that feeling. All right, it's that lunch. But what do you want? Do you have anything important you need to go through with me? Welcome, welcome. Yeah, I know, I know. So not too much there. I did see some like golden coins over here. Not golden coins, but like the rings. Oh yeah, so we can hop off the top of this. Very cool. Okay, so when it was talking to me about the other one, it was actually over here a bit more. So it definitely, oh yeah, just right up here. We should be able to do that if I uh, go like this. Oh, well, maybe not like that. But, uh, maybe I can't get up here. Wait, oh, come on, I'm getting so close to it. Uh, there must be a better way. I'm sure there is. The chances are that there is indeed a better way if Mario knew how to platform. I thought he did, it's really his job. Oh my gosh, come on. Uh, all right, we'll try it from the, the Big Apple. Not New York, not New Donk City. That's a different kind of big apple. Um, there we go. We'll probably talk to Talkatu as well, but Talkatu really doesn't help me on all that much, to be honest with you. But we'll give it a shot, see what happens. All right, so get over here and butt slam this bad boy and get another one. Okay, so that is the top of column in a room. I guess maybe Talkatu could have helped me with that one if I heard that, but I probably would have went right over my head, literally. What is the secret you were seeking? An extreme simmer. Yeah, wasn't, where was that at? An extreme simmer, huh? Was that in here? I don't think so, but I had the outfit, I could just go in. Cause I know there was an area where I was like confused on what I had to do. Yeah, it was this area. It gave me the idea, nothing worse than a so so simmer. So maybe if I just keep on, okay, thanks game. Um, maybe if I keep on plopping dudes into this. Okay, I swear that didn't work last time, but there's a moon, um, oh, and that is a strong simmer. What about the other areas? If I pop you into the other one, oh, oh yeah, okay. So I remember doing this and not being able to do so well, but I'll try better this time, or try harder. I'll try my best no matter what I always do. Okay, buddy, I need you to do that, I need you to do that, and that, and then I shouldn't need to go up there. So all I need is Yoon and Yoon. Okay, ow. Rude, dude. There we go. Okay, so jump. Go, 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 jump. Oh, no. Oh, come on. Come on, Mario, you're being silly. All right, one more. You got it? Okay, this time it's not gonna be a problem. I'm just gonna jump. Move it, move it, jump. Wow, come on. Am I gonna be able to do this? Did I mess this up? Don't fall in the lava or the magma or whatever it is. Ready? Yup, that's not it. Whoop, ready, whoop, 
There we go. Wait, why are you guys back? That don't make no sense. Hold on. I did it. And then I, big jump and big land. Okay, so that gives me a moon too. I swear I did that. Or maybe, maybe I didn't. Okay, well, I did that, and that is an extreme simmer. So that's good. I think that's everything I can do in this area, Freon. Because I remember, yeah, we didn't actually get a moon out of this. I thought we did. Um, and now this way. I love his little fork prong sticking out as if it's a hand guiding Mario. That is so adorable. Okay, well, there's that done. That leaves us with seven more to collect. One of which is a moon moon. The other ones, there's one over here. We'll talk to uh, Talkatu again, because he should have more hints. Hey, Talkatu, how you doing? Uh, Found with Lunch in Kingdom Hearts. So we can't find that one, I don't think. Well, actually, we never went out there to take that on. By the cannon pointed at the big pond. It's hiding somewhere in OP King. And anything else right now? Treasure beneath the cheese rocks. Okay. Well, there's a couple more. Now, like I said, there is one that is, is probably not gonna help me out too much. Oh no! Okay. I need to find a way up here because there is a picture somewhere um, over there. One, two, three. Oh, what? Oh, come on, game. Don't be silly like that. Ready? One, two, three. Yeah, okay. Oh, the music like immediately disappears. Marion, does that not work for a real reason, buddy? Oh, there we go, there we go. I'm up here now. There we go. Okay, so let's take a read of this. This is gonna be that moon. Another Poochie one. Okay, interesting. We're gonna have to find those eventually, but not now. So I need to get over here and check out what the hullabaloo about that is. And that's gonna be a little bit farther off. Uh, let's teleport over here. Might make it a little bit quicker and easier for me. If I could just get a good view of it, like that's gonna be a big deal too. So we'll have to find out together. Because mm -hmm. I don't know if it'll be up there or not. It's sort of picky sometimes. All right, well, I don't know really where I'm landing here. I guess here. Oh gosh, I'm just gonna immediately slide. Well, I missed it anyways. Apparently it's like over here. Like I'm right around it. I'm not exactly on top of it, but I'm around it. Hmm. Weird. Let's take a better look at that then. Oh, it's on, on the salt pile. No, no it's not. Yeah, it's definitely farther over than that. If I land here, I'm still like, it's over here. It's just that's super weird. Maybe I could do something with the lava, probably something with the lava. So let's wiggle on over there. And it would be over here. So it's definitely nothing to, oh wait. I see, that is a weird one. Like, like how it, thanks Mario. Um, I don't see how I could be expected to find something like that on my own. Like that is such a happenstance thing to find. I don't see how in the world you could find that without a hit. I mean, maybe that's just what they expect. Cause that's like one of the few moons that doesn't really point itself out very well. It's just sort of there. All right, well, come on. There you go. No, Mario, you were fine. Don't ruin it. There you go. That, that moon's total malarkey. Surrounded by tall mountains. Okay, so, I wanna go over here because clearly there's something like in this river thing here. Well, actually, I don't know really exactly where that is. It's hard to tell. Once again, this is where there's a lot of verticality, so it could be under something, it could be next to it. It's really, really hard to figure it out. I'm gonna first check over here, because it might just be as easy as that. It might just be, ooh, 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 I'm so dead. Oh, I'm not dead, but I got really close, okay? No, and this is way far off. Huh. I mean, it might be at the top. It's really, it's just so easy to lose your way with this stuff. Okay. All right, let me get back over here then. And then go like that. And like here, I'm, I think it's above then. I mean, I can check that one platform there. Cause like, it would be, yeah, I think it's up above. So if we go here to the peak, we should be able to figure stuff out up there. Maybe that'd be easier, but only one way to find out now, isn't there? 
Okay. So. I mean, mm, it's so weird. It's so hard to tell. Also, you can see the, the shadow of the flag, which is weird. The shadows are weird here. It, it, that's weird. Um, oh, it's up here. I see it. Once again, another really inconspicuous one. So that was gonna be the one by the, yep, by the big pot. Okay. By the cannon pointing at the big pot. So we got five more left to find. Are any of those hinted at? Found with the Lunch of Kingdom Art. We can't do that one right now. So we only need four left to find. Okay, so if I have no clue, then I'll definitely go back to talk a two. <laughs> nice little rhyme there, right? Uh, okay, something will surely happen. Hey, everybody. I still, above and beyond, can't we? Oh, you know what? He's going to the moon. Above and beyond. That only makes sense, right? I think he's going to the moon. So we'll see him on the moon. Um, hi! I'm talking, talking to, he's over this way, I forgot. I still have four more purple coins I definitely want to find before the end of today's episode. What's the secret you were seeking? Diving from the big pot. We can go back up to the big pot through that pipe, that, that cannon then. Uh, treasure beneath the cheese rocks. That one I'm still stuck on. Anything more? Found with Launching Kingdom Iron. I don't think I'm gonna get anything more than that. Diving from the big pot. Yeah, oh, no, that's what I just, yeah. Okay, never mind. So. Go back to where I was, become one of the lavas, and then dive from the big pot? I mean, what else could I do? I mean, it's a big pot. It is the biggest pot. So I would hope that it would be called the big pot. There we go. So let's get up here. Whoop. Yep. Okay, so let's launch up here and see what's going on. Yeah, I actually, I forgot that I can even explore this area. So this is probably where the last couple moons will be. One thing, I see one right here. Oh, this might be a bit tough. Uh, big jump, because we can just accidentally run into things. It's very easy to lose your trajectory on this thing. Ow, 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 okay, no, I'm not done. Great, 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 great. Oh, boy. Oh, boy. Come on, come on, ow, ow. Okay, we're not done. Jeez, it just never stops. Oh, it's a nightmare. Got it, got it, got it. Nice, okay, that's it, wow. So out of our four left to get, this is one of them, leaving us with three. You know, not including, of course, the, the painting one. Okay, that's Big Pot Swim, taking notes. And then I can dive from this for whatever reason and get a moon. Where and how exactly, that's hard to say. I'm gonna look for an area that like maybe I wouldn't normally be able to get to in any feasible way without hopping from the Big Pot but I don't see what that would be. Like the top of a mountain maybe. Like maybe it is just really just like on the... That wouldn't make any sense. Yeah, we get hurt by just going near that. Weird, I'm not sure. Okay, we're just gonna keep sliding. Okay, see you, see you in the next lifetime. Yep, and there you go. <laughs> I thought that was my last hit. I'm going to then teleport back to the Odyssey, and then maybe back there I can get the Hento to help me out with this one, because the location is confusing me. This one's just weird. I don't know. Hinto to help me. Hi, Hinto. Hey. Okay, we're gonna buy a hint. There. And I think that's what we're looking for. So if I could just inspect that area a bit farther, that'd be fantastic, so. I'll do just that. I mean, maybe it is just floating around in the air and I just really missed it, but it's, it's really hard to tell. Trying to find a way to get up there is tough without the big pot, so that's probably the idea, but I did it. Okay, so yeah, I guess that's the idea, is that you weren't supposed to get up here with the big pot, but it's like it's quite easy to get up here. All right, there we go. So what more do we have to find? Overlooking a bunch of ingredients. Well, that wasn't take a dive from the big pot then, which means they're still diving from the big pot and then found with Lunch of Kingdom Art, and then one more. And that one's treasure beneath the cheese rock. So let's see if we can't, I mean, I've looked under every cheese rock I thought I could find. I mean, maybe there's another one back at the beginning. All right, well, I'll keep looking. But a lot of, I have to say this one might have some of the most, I guess, cheap feeling moons in the game. It's just like, some of these, like, I would not be able to just stumble across that. It's just in such an inconspicuous area. But yes, I think that we need to get a frying pan throwing dude and get him all the way here. That's gonna be 
white the challenge, I can only believe. Because, I mean, the closest ones I know are right over here, and making this jump is a real challenge with him. Can we even? Well, no, those guys are flame dudes as well. Flame doesn't take care of the cheese. Oh, but you. You are what I'm looking for. So I can't go across to there. To do it, I'm gonna have to get up like that, and then, oh, these look like little staircases made just for him. Perfect. <laughs> That's actually pretty cool. So, everyone's like, oh no! Oh no, he's ruining the festival! No, it's just me, Mario! In silly form. Okay, so, oh, don't fall, please. Okay, so we just need to make our way across. It actually shouldn't be too bad now that we've done it. Like, I'm like, hey, this is pretty easy. Let's get rid of you guys, just because I get an extra coin or two and I'm gonna really need that. Please leave me alone now. Whoa, we got some speed build up there for a second. Scared me. Okay, so what is beneath this cheese? Surely a treasure. Okay, yep, okay, look at this one. I found this one out on my own. Well, I mean, I found out with a hint, but awesome. Treasure beneath the cheese rocks. Okay, so. Now that I found that one, I can pay you for another hint. And you should give me either the painting one, which would be stinky. No, you're giving me, okay. Oh, I understand now. The only way to get somebody, okay. I should have pieced that one together too. I was like, it was right in my face. I was starting to think about that one in the back of my head. Like, what about that pot on top of the store? You hop from the one pot into the other pot. They should have named that like a, a pot from pot jump or something. I would have gotten that better. Oh well. Let's go again. Flying way up here once more. But now I know where I'm going. I just gotta figure out exactly where to land. Um, There's the one pot. I need, oh boy, this might be a bit of a mistake. Let's see if I can. Trajectory is not very good with that. Not one bit. Come on, come on, come on, that's perfect. Yes! Oh my gosh, finally! That took like almost 10 tries, and it's just gonna go back over there and wait for the loading screen and diving from the big pot. There, so the only thing I can do now is get the four purple coins. So, I gotta look for those now. Wherever they may be. Oh, hey! There's purple coins in here. Um, okay, there's another one. Uh, and there's the last one, okay. Wow. There we go, 100. Which means I can buy the rest of whatever's in here. That, those were sneaky ones right there. All right, let me go ahead and go to the shop over here. Just like that. And we're good to go get it. This is awesome. Um, And then we're on, so at this point, until we get that one from the other kingdom, the, lake, the seaside kingdom, we're 100% done with this kingdom, which is awesome. Luncheon Kingdom sticker, a sticker inspired by per Peranza Plaza. Awesome, I'll buy that. We are almost done with getting all the purple coin related stuff, which is really cool as well. And souvenir forks inspired by the people of Mount Volbono. This cute pair of tall and short forks looks a bit like a parent and child. Adorable. And then finally, our um, little statue. This is the vegetable plate. This toy food lets you pretend you're cooking with real ingredients from Mount Volbono. They can also be stacked up like rocks, or like blocks. <laughs> cool. And there we go, there is everything we can do right now in Mount Volbono. Very, very cool, not Volbono, but uh, you know, uh, Lunch and Kingdom. But we still have time left in today's episode, so I figured today could be a combo episode since next we have the incredibly small kingdom, the, uh, what's it called, kingdom? Why don't we go ahead and try it out, the Ruined Kingdom? I think that we'll probably unlock the moon rock, it'll probably be unlocking like three or four moons at most, so we'll get that done. And we'll see what we can do. We have 673 moons in total, which is insane. Let's go. Head off to another kingdom, of course, of course. What else? And we're gonna go to the Ruined Kingdom, where hopefully we can get some cool stuff done. I don't think that Peach will be here. She said she was gonna go to the kingdom that always is storming, which is interesting, because this will be the only kingdom that she doesn't go to if that's the case. Every other kingdom we visited so far, even the Cloud Kingdom and the Ruined Kingdom, she was there. So we'll find out now. After I skip that cutscene, and we keep going. Ruined Kingdom, I mean, it might be this, obviously it is storming, but why would Peach come here? I don't think she is. Because if we, you know, just take a second. Hmm? The moon rock here is going too, let's be sure to check that. I'm gonna change my costume though. It would be cool if Mario had like a knight armor costume. I don't think he does, but that would be very cool. So, uh. Um, Let's just go on to this. We'll, we'll, we'll apply a costume we've never had before. Let's do the samurai. Now we'll click a samurai going to defeat the dragon. 
in our new adventure, Dark Souls Mario Edition for the Nintendo Switch. Um, so yeah, let us first check. We already only need one more moon. That's probably Visiting Peach. I would not believe that she's here, but it's possible. Anyways, down here we have the moon rock, so let me handle that too, just like that. And more moons on this forsaken area. Sure, why not? I can't imagine there's gonna be very many. Imagine if there's like 50 moons to collect. It's just like this overwhelmingly crowded area just full of moon after moon after moon after moon. Half of them are like are in the ground or there's a bird flying. Every single one of these bats you see on the screen has a moon. Like, oh my gosh. It's just insanity. No, that's not gonna happen, hopefully. How many do we have? One, two, three, four, five more moons. Okay, that's not too bad, we can do that. So let's first go into the moon pipe over there, and then plus the uh, one we already had to do, that six in total we have in this area. And there's no purple coin to worry about either, which is just fantastic, so. Uh, I'm just sick of collecting purple coins sometimes. It's just always, I'm not sick of collecting purple coins, I'm sick of scrounging for that one that's hidden in a corner somewhere in the world, you know? Okay, let us go down here and find out what more we can see. This is probably gonna be challenging, I just have a feeling. Oh, it looks challenging. So first, let me sort of scout this area out. What is up here, what is this purpose? Uh, to be honest with you, I don't know. Either way, I don't, oh my, there's a charge in Chuck. Cool. So I wonder if one of the moons is gonna be like hidden in something? Oh, probably in here. Oh, oh hey guys. All right, so I guess we have poles to climb up in case we get overwhelmed. Well, I'm gonna try to get the charge in Chuck so I can become him. All right, Chuck, help me out here. All right, get you, get you. Oh, this is cool. All right, charge up, let it rip. So we're gonna charge right through into this area and see what's happening. Oh wow, that was just lots of coins, which is great to some extent. Oh wow, okay. This is ridiculous. Oh yeah, I see you up there, buddy. All right. Come on, come on. Come on, ow. Why are they all popping up everywhere? You get back here! I wasn't done with you. Come on, come back, ready? Ah, you guys stink. There it is, finally, geez. Where's that going? Way over there. Um, I need to get over there quick. Get a full health restore, the mummy army's curse. You can say that again. Is the charging chuck down there again? He is not, that's fine. One, two, three. All right, whoa, leave me alone, leave me alone. Oh. So now I just need you one more time. We're gonna charge, 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 like this. I mean, we got some, you know, surprisingly sharp turning out of him. Well, until the screen decides to change its mind. Here, come on. There we go. I would care about those coins, but I don't care about those coins anymore. Charge and Chuck, what the heck's your problem? Dude. There, geez. Come on, there we go. Get that moon and get the heck out of this place. Charging through an army. You can say that again. All right, Samurai Mario, go down here. I mean, I should probably be equipping this in the Bowser Kingdom. We probably will just hold on to it until then, but um, I don't know. Does it really matter? So over here, we have one more left. It apparently is like right over there. I mean, it might just be in the floor, it might be something more. It might be hidden in a door. It might be down here. Weird. Maybe it's below? Doesn't appear to be so. Can you grab on the map? Thank you. Shake the Joy-Cons like a silly butt and then plop down. Huh. Oh, you, you know what? It's probably on top of here. Yes, it definitely is. It totally is. Up on top of here. Yep, I found it. Don't worry. Okay. Even even small levels like this are gonna have verticality upon the broken arch. Gosh, this level just can't get any more creepy. It's definitely the creepiest Mario level. I have to say. Like in any Mario game, I think this might be the creepiest Mario level. I know there's that one in like Galaxy where they like sort of peer over you. Like there's like evil aliens or something. Can we talk to you? So tired. Oh hey, look at you guys. What are you doing here with a sundress? I don't know, it just seems silly. Uh, this kingdom, well, let's just say it's a fixer-upper. 
As long as I'm with Peach, I'll be fine, I'm sure. But I did find a power moon here. I hope it's useful to you in your travels. Well, hopefully, you know, you being a princess and all can help other kingdoms out. Peach in the ruined kingdom. That castle. This could be a good opportunity to finally go there on my own free will. Oh, you mean Bowser's castle. Okay. He just looks at you and it's so creepy. <laughs> creepy, crawly. So there's a moon. It's not the, the moon moon. So there's the only moon we were missing. When it comes to this other one. Oh, it's this rock. Yep, okay, that's actually not too bad. <laughs> and then that's, there's another one. Like chilling out outside of the boundary. So I might have to go on to uh, the dragon himself. Jeez, this thing just doesn't stop, does it? All right, kick it towards the wall so it has like two hits it takes. Oh, there you go. And then hit it that way, wait. Jeez, it just, it never falters. Just like everything else in this kingdom, it lasts far past its expiration date. Jeez, come on, come on. <laughs> this rock will break sometime soon and when it does, I'll be here. Come on. Am I doing something wrong? Maybe I could get the dragon over there just to, to munch on it real quick. It just doesn't stop. I have to be doing something wrong. It doesn't show any signs of actually breaking. Finally, oh my gosh. That was one tough rock, rolling rock in the battlefield. Well, I guess if you want to be a rock in a battlefield, you gotta be one, you know, like one heck of a rock, basically. Um, so we can just climb on you. You don't seem to care. Jeez, you are creepy, dude. I mean, no offense. Like, is that supposed to be taken that way? I mean, unless you do, just please don't eat me. Maybe it's on like his horn. Yes, it is. There we go. Sorry, but you got a little bit of a moon in your air. I got it for you, don't worry. Wow, I like how it shined off the sun there. That was really cool. I haven't seen that effect in the game. Okay, let's go and get our final moon of the Rune King. The Rune Kingdom 100% complete, caught on a big horn. Yeah, 100%. Okay. So there we go, yet another kingdom completed in today's episode of Super Mario Odyssey. If you watch this part of the video, make sure you comment Zebra Chef so that you've watched to the end and that you are a Zebratastic viewer. Check out more of this is like this one on your screen right now or by subscribing and join the Zebra Herd. Either way, thank you guys so much for watching. I'll see you next time. Bye bye.